going to now get to the third mass shooting in the Houston area in a week. Be on the lookout tonight for this man. Investigators say he opened fire at a flea market and shot and killed a 10 year old boy and wounded four others. It happened off North Main Street near the South Belt around 530 yesterday afternoon. KPRC 2's Rochelle Turner is live there tonight with the newest information on the search for the suspected killer. Rochelle. Keith, the Texas Department of Public Safety says David Norgette is listed as one of the top 10 most wanted fugitives in the state. Now, Pearland police say he may not be the only suspect involved in this shooting. A 10 year old child was killed in a senseless manner. So any support we can get, whether it's financially or the public, is very welcomed in this case. Pearland police are working to find this man, David Norgette. He should be considered armed and dangerous. I don't know his criminal record. It's my understanding he is fairly local to the Pearland area. Police say the 19 year old got into an argument with another man at Cole's flea market Sunday afternoon, which led to a deadly shooting. Law enforcement shut down parts of Highway 35 and North Main Street to collect evidence. This picture from a business across the street shows the heavy police presence as investigators work to determine a motive. We believe there's at least one more, if not two other people that actually had handguns and may have fired those firearms. Five people were hurt. Police say three innocent bystanders were hit in the crossfire. The youngest victim, a 10 year old boy who died at the hospital. The two other people who were injured are being questioned for their involvement. A cash reward for $15,000 is being offered for information leading to the whereabouts of David Nergette. Officials want him off the streets and they're asking for the public's help. Extremely tragic for the city of Pearland, tragic for Coles Flea Market, tragic for all the families that attend that flea market, tragic for the families that work at that flea market trying to provide a living for their, for just, like you said, the holiday times. Um, and to know that this senseless act of violence, whatever caused it to happen, which we will figure out what caused it to happen. Tonight, it's unclear when the flea market behind me will reopen. The names of the people who were injured in the shooting have not been released. But if you know where David Negrete may be, you're asked to call Pearland Police or the Brazoria County Crime Stoppers Office. You can remain anonymous. Reporting live in Pearland, I'm Rochelle Turner, KPRC 2 News. All right, Rochelle, thank you.